<clears throat> Hello and welcome, it's TV Gaming here. In today's tutorial, I want to show you how to build this desert house. As you can see, it is a quite compact design and it is actually quite easy to build as well. So let's actually go inside and let me show you the interior of this house. As you can see, this is a quite nice design and it is actually a very simple design which looks quite nice. We got a lot of storage on the corners. We got a bedroom, we got a cooking area, and we got a enchanting area over here. Now, if you want to build along, there will be a list in the description. Once you got everything, let's get started. I start with outlining the build. So you want to have a pillar and then two one white windows. So that add another pillar over here. Go back in one block. Then we're going to have the entrance on this side. So you just want to add a block skip two blocks and let's repeat the same thing okay once that's done we are going to build in the sides instead of the entrance we are going to simply have a wall so you just want to do the same thing again but this time we want to go out four blocks and then repeat it on this side. On the back side, we are going to do the exact same thing. Okay, once that's done, we are going to build up each pillar by six blocks. One, two, three, four, five, six, and let's do this for each one. Then let's build in the windows as well. Which is going to be quite simple. You just want to build it up and cover it like this. Now, before we build up the walls, we are going to add an additional block on top of each arch shape over here. Then you want to go in and up, connect these two points and we're going to do that for each one. But first let's build in the entrance. Okay, now let's repeat this on each one. After that, we're going to build up the walls. So you want to go on the back side and build it up. Then we're going to build in the windows. So we're going to simply add some stairs. Then you just want to cover it up with some black stained glass paint. Take your trapdoors, place it in. Just like that. Now let's repeat this for each one. Now we're going to add some additional stairs. So you just want to add it in underneath over here. Then take some sandstone stairs and we're going to add it in as well. Then take some sandstone stairs and we're going to add it in you want to skip the pillars next to the entrances and just add it in 
and take some sandstone slabs and go all the way around. And again, we are going to add some sandstone underneath as well. We want to skip the corners. After that, we are going to decorate the pillars. So you want to add two ladders, a chain and a lantern. After that, that's built in the entrance area. So you want to take some stairs, place it in like this, followed with some chains going up. Here you want to add two additional ones with a lantern. Then on the back side, you want to add a temporary block followed with two glowstone. Take your doors and place it in as well. Then place some iron bars going across. Take the acacia buttons and you want to add it in on top like this. And you want to add an additional one underneath. Then we are going to build in a entrance. So you want to get rid of four blocks. Add some polish to the side. And let's go back a couple more blocks. So now let's actually go out just one more block. After that, then take some slabs and cover this up. Let's mix in some cobblestone as well. Take your slabs and you want to go all the way around and make sure that you have at least three or four blocks of space on each side. So you can count in from this one, two, three, four. You get the idea. You can just go all the way around. Okay, once that is done, what we're going to do is we're going to decorate these sides. So you want to start off with some sandstone stairs. Add it in like this. And you want to add some additional stairs again. Take some iron bars, go all the way around. Then add your ladders going up. On the sides, you want to add chains and a lantern. After that, take some buttons again and you want to place it in. The same way as we've done for the entrance. So let's do this for each one. Then you want to go in one block and get rid of these. We're going to add some sugar cane. I'm sure at this point you want to stop. Here we can just add one more and you get the idea, you just want to go all the way around. Okay, now let's place in some sugar cane. You want to skip these sides. Then let's add a lantern on each corner and in front of these stairs as well. Here we go. After that, we're going to build up some of these. So let's start off with one side. Just want to skip one block and add one more slab on top. It doesn't really matter if it doesn't line up perfectly. Then go ahead and place an iron bar on each one. Now before we add in the roof, let's light up the inside. So you just want to add some torches on each pillar. And you want to simply light this up temporarily so that nothing spawns while we add the roof in. 
Now let's actually start with the art shapes. You just want to add some stairs like this and add one additional on the sides. And underneath you want to add some stairs again. Okay, here we're going to have an extra stair, so you just want to go in like this. Make sure that you add a couple more on the back side. And we're going to do this for each one. that you want to take some bridge trap doors and we're going to add it in cross then you want to take some stairs and we're going to connect these two art shapes together okay let's do that for each one Yeah, once you got one row in, it's going to be much easier. So we're going to add some full blocks on the back side. After that, we are going to build in each one exactly the same way until this point. At this point, we want to add one more row of full blocks on the back side. Then we're going to add some slabs at the corners and two on these art shapes. After that, you can just simply skip one block and add another slab. And in between, you want to add some trapdoors. After that, you can just cover this up with some dark oak slabs. Then you want to go at the center, which is quite easy to find. You want to go in line with this block that block then you can just get rid of this and obviously you want to make sure that we are in line with this as well so once you got the center we're going to go up just indicate it like this and you just want to add a singular campfire it doesn't really matter where you place it as long as it is actually near the center then take some close down and you want to go up from the second row go in four blocks so one two three four Get rid of this, add a close stone, go diagonally one block. Next to this, you just want to add another close stone. After that, you can just simply add a trapdoor. This is going to light up the roof as well, and it is actually going to give us a little bit more decoration. So let's do this on each side. Now let's go inside and let's start working on the interior of this house. Now to make things easier, we can leave the floor with some sand just to make things easier. First, we need to add some additional blocks, pillars on the inside. So you want to take some cut sandstone. We're going to go in diagonally like this so here. On the sides, we're going to add some extra pillars as well. Okay, now let's build each one up until this point.
then take some dark oak stairs and we're going to add it in we're going to make a straight line so we need to add a lot more on these sides so first let's slide it up then take the dark oak stairs like i said you want to go in until this point and add your stairs i actually forgot this side so let me quickly get this in Okay, now let's continue with the stairs. Here we go. Now we're going to add some additional stairs underneath the arch shapes. So you just want to go in. Some sandstone stairs. go okay now let's add some full blocks going across and that's just take some sandstone stairs we're going to add it in now for the last row we are going to use some red sandstone stairs then you want to take some circular oak planks and we're going to change the floor a little bit. So we want to go in line with this pillar. Go in until this point. We're going to make a huge plus shape. And add some circular oak wood. Then you want to get rid of everything in between. Take some dark oak planks and place it in. Then take some cut redstone. And we're going to use the corners for some storage. So you just want to go in. And leave yourself a one block gap. And go across again. Okay, you don't have to have the entrances at the exact same place. You can do it like I did. Take some barrels and place it on top. Yep. As you can see, we got three windows on the side. So what we're going to do is we're going to use some chests. First, on the inner sides. Then again, we're going to add some barrels going up. Okay, let's do this for each corner. Now that is done, we're going to build in a bedroom and we're going to use this side. You can actually use which side you want to, it doesn't really matter. So to start off, you want to add some full blocks going in. Add four in total. Add two beds on top. On the back side, you want to add two stairs and go up with some sandstone again, like this. Add some stairs, followed with some iron bars going up. Then you want to add some buttons going up again, some stairs. Take your ladders and go all the way up just like this okay now that is done you want to add your trap doors and open it up right here we're going to have a cooking area so you want to add six campfires going up then you want to go in with some stairs on the sides go up with some ladders followed with two chains and a lantern on both sides you take the crafting table, place it in, add your stairs, followed with some ladders again. If you want to, you can even go across with your stairs. Right here, we are going to have some bookshelves. Now, this is not going to be perfectly symmetrical, unfortunately, but it doesn't really matter. So you want to add your enchanting table. doesn't really matter which side. Then you want to go in and go across like this 
take a grindstone and place it next to it then you can just add some bookshelves again here we just want to go all the way up and go across take your chain place it in followed with a lantern and on the sides you get the idea we're going to go across with some stairs and add in some ladders okay now let's light up everything so the easiest way to do that is to add some chains you can even add two on each side if you want to then go ahead and place some lanterns Then you can take some polished black stone button and add it on top of each sandstone. Well, this is just for decoration, obviously. Take some acacia trapdoors and place it on top of the bookshelves. And the last thing we need to do is to decorate the entrance. So you just want to simply add some stairs and then go up with some chains on the corners. And on top of this, and here we go that is going to be the basic decoration with some stairs obviously and you can definitely add a lot more things to this but i'm going to keep it as it is because i'm actually pretty happy with how this one turned out and hopefully you all enjoyed this as well and if you did please leave a like and subscribe have a nice day i'll see you the next time